season long. This is ninth start. Expects to handle the championship game nerves just fine tonight. And it's Travis Etienne looking for the room on the right side and finding it. Etienne into the secondary. A foot race. They won't catch him, and the Tigers score on the opening play. 75 yards. Well, that's how you get championship weekend started for the Clemson Tigers. Strike up the bat in the ACC championship. Bring back Mr. Wilkins. It's ETN. Long touchdown to open the game. Short touchdown to make it 13 nothing. And the nightmare start for the big dogs from Pittsburgh continues. Student made a clutch catch there. Olison. Gets to the edge, stiff arm against Simmons, down the sidelines, dives! Where will they mark him? No signal yet. Touchdown, they finally say he got in. And the Panthers strike back. You talked about how Isaiah Simmons didn't have a great game. Watch him come out here and try to make this play one-on-one. -on -one. Gets the stiff arm. There's the physical part of Olison. And then, it, boy, it looked like he may have stepped out of bounds there, but the receivers do a good job blocking downfield. They're going to definitely take a peek at that, and there he is. He's, he's out of bounds there. 140-pound fullback in front of him. Dives airborne for the touchdown. To be just like him, but he said his family has closure coming into this season, and that's been important. Sure was, and now ETN breaks free. As he again is sparking this Clemson offense, he's deep into Pittsburgh territory. Under the only senior among the running backs. Lawrence, Enzo, caught. Touchdown, T. Higgins went up, got the ball, and they say got the foot down. Let's make sure. 6-4, one-on-one. They've been tight coverage this entire drive. Now the Tigers trying to add to the lead. Lawrence for the end zone, just like that. They make the Panthers pay Higgins for the second time tonight. I put the little the little marker on Higgins because if I'm a quarterback and I got 29 seconds to go. Final play of the third quarter. It's a flea flicker and left to get downfield to a wide open Justin Ross, who's going to be stopped just short of the goal line. Trickery to end the third period. And they brought a corner blitz with Jackson, which meant the safety had one-on-one -on -one coverage, and Briggs was late to respond. You see how Ross kind of slow-played it, showed like he was going to block? Briggs fell for it. Did he get in there? Yes. No doubt that time. Choice. That was a great win that day in that atmosphere. Uh-oh. Look out. Bryce keeps it. Has a crease. And it's going to be Josh. Tripped up at the five. He was thinking about scoring there. First and goal. And there's the young man bouncing it in. Dixon scores. And the next wave of talented Tigers making plays. White sweatshirt. And that didn't look very good with the orange Gatorade. So now he goes all orange tonight. And it's a, <laughs> it's a rank. They got, they, they got it pretty good. Uh, how would you describe what this team has just proven here today? <laughs> well, same thing they've proven all year, man. They've been up to the challenge, up to the task all year. Unbelievable leadership. You can't win four in a row if you don't win one, two, and three. So, you know, shout out to all those teams who put us in this position to have an opportunity to do something for the first time. But, man, I'm just so proud of, of my staff and my team. I'm thankful. You know, this is... Ten years ago today, I got hired at Clemson. Ten years ago today, and uh, so uh, appreciate Terry Don Phillips, you know, having a vision and giving me that opportunity ten years ago. Uh, I slept good ten years ago that night, and I'm going to sleep good tonight.